Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday and happy Magic Mail Monday. I have been loving summer lately. I have been barely sitting down to film anything because the weather here in Minnesota has been stunning and uh, Aaron, my, my husband, cut his finger and he's a violinist and he wasn't able to go to work for a couple of weeks. So we've been taking advantage of that time to like go outside and uh, take the dog out and enjoy nature and the weather. And it's been amazing and in all of that running around outside I kind of worn myself out so actually as I'm sitting down to film this today I'm feeling a little bit under the weather like I'm feeling a little bit zonked so I'm not sure how much mail I'm gonna get through I have a large stack of Disney P.O. Box mail from you in front of me and uh, I'm actually quite behind on magic mail so I'm gonna get through um, as much as I can it's very important for me to be able to, to thank you personally or as personally as I can um, through video I'm gonna jump right in and and um, just before I do, I want to say thank you so much to everyone who has sent me anything. And I know a few people have been um, worried about their packages missing, and I am looking. And if you sent me an email, um, I'll email you back because th that is on my mind. Uh, anyway, let's jump into some magic mail, and here we go. The first package I have today comes from Tiffany in Georgia. Tiffany in Georgia. Hi, Tiffany. And I'll just show you the uh, the front of the envelope. I'll cover her address, but there is a cute um, Aladdin, uh, Jasmine, and Raja sticker, and then there's also a cool um, Riviera Resort uh, Walt Disney World sticker, the newest resort in Walt Disney World. So I love the stickers, Tiffany. Thank you. And thank you so much for sending me magic mail. I've already snipped this open and I see that there is a card and a little bubble wrapped something. So let me dig into the card first. Ooh, I love the card. Super blingy Disney uh, Mickey Mouse card. I love these uh, papyrus. Uh, Disney cards. They're pretty awesome. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Um, okay, it says, Hi Becca. When I saw this pin on Etsy, I just knew you had to have it. Disney Dogs and Harry Potter may be my favorite mashup ever. And when I saw that lady was Ravenclaw, it seemed fated for you. That is so nice. She says she also picked one up for herself. So I guess we are pin twins. Thank you so much, Tiffany. She says, I hope to meet you in the park someday. I hope to meet you as well. Okay, so I think the pin must be in this package, but this is um, the postcard that came in the package as well. Check this out. It is Lady in her Ravenclaw guard. She's got her, her cap and her scarf and also her wand in her mouth. And I'm guessing that the pin might be this design, which just makes me so excited because I am a huge uh, Ravenclaw Harry Potter fan, Ravenclaw represent here, and I also obviously love, you know, Disney dogs and, and Lady and the Tramp, and Lady reminds me so much of my own dog, Molly, mostly like in terms of their temperament. So let's take a quick peek. Thank you, Tiffany, for, for thinking of me. Oh my goodness, this is just so cute and adorable. So here she is, Lady, as a pin in her Ravenclaw outfit. She looks so beautiful. This just makes my heart happy. And uh, down here at the bottom, there's the initials S-A-L. That must be the pin designer. And I will look this up and put a link down below because I know I have a lot of Disney fans who are also Harry Potter fans. And I'm also curious to see um, what the designer did for the other, the other three houses. So that's so awesome. Thank you so much, Tiffany. I absolutely love her. This isn't like a pin mail specific magic mail video today, but I didn't know there was a pin in there. And this is just thrilling and I love the postcard too. I'm gonna have to find a place to put the postcard on display because Ravenclaw. The next package I have in front of me is from Julie. Julie in Germany and Julie has sent me magic mail a handful of times and it always boggles my mind when people send me multiple magic mails. It's just so kind and, um, and so thoughtful and um, back when I first started my channel I had time to handwrite notes back to people um, and, I, and I don't anymore which is why I started this video series. Um, so the fact that people are just kindly sending me things without expecting anything in return really means the world to me and it kind of restores my faith in humanity. So thank you so much, Julie. I'm excited to see what you sent. Oh yes, I think some of my favorite treats ever um, are in this package. If you haven't watched many of my magic mail videos before, I've made a big deal out of these in the past because they're like the most delicious treats ever. These are the Kinder Happy Hippo treats and they're like these little amazing 
wafer cookies that are filled with like chocolate hazelnut filling. They are delicious. Sometimes I open them and eat them on camera and like show an example, but because I'm not feeling like super great right now, I'm actually not gonna eat one right now. But if you are in Europe or if you are, uh, want to go on Amazon or go to World Market, you can find these little Kinder Hippo treats. And this is like one of my favorite little naughty little snacks ever. And Julie um, has sent them to me in the past and I super appreciate you sending them again. Thank you. I am gonna stash these away and try to hide them from my husband because he also loves them. All right, got the treats out of the way. And now I'm gonna open up um, the card that she sent. There's a little beast from Beauty and the Beast sticker sealing the card shut. And, oh my gosh, look at this stationery. We have um, Snow White and her prince on this gorgeous stationery. And I will, um, oh wow, I will read this to myself off camera because we've had some personal conversations. But I know that Julie just welcomed a, a new addition to her family. And um, I wanna say congratulations on, on your sweet newest addition. So, oh my gosh, thank you so much for sharing uh, the birth of your daughter with me. We've had a lot of bonding over this specific topic. And then also tucked into the card, there is um, a photograph of my favorite scene from um, Pirates of the Caribbean, the, the dog with the key. She says, I snapped this picture of your favorite scene in the Pirates ride at Disneyland Paris. I had to think of you. Thank you so much. That was so thoughtful and congrats again and I'll keep uh, the rest of your note, etc., to myself. And then also there is something else that was tucked into the package. I wonder if this is, yes, I think this is a, um, a pillowcase, a pillow cover of Snow White because I have one um, that's Belle in this kind of same design and now she sent me a Snow White one as well so I can have a matching Belle and Snow White pillow. So this is the cover and then you just slide the uh, appropriately sized pillow inside of here. Look how cute she is. That is adorable and I love the little heart up here in the corner too. Thank you so much, Julie, for sharing your, your life with me and also um, for the, the pillow cover and all the chocolatey goodies and treats. That means a lot and big hugs to you in Germany. I'm thinking of taking a trip out to uh, Disneyland Paris next year, next spring, and I'm hoping to connect with some people I've met in Europe maybe on that trip, so fingers crossed. The next package I have today is also from overseas. This is actually coming from Ireland, from Natasha in Ireland. Hi, Natasha, I recognize your name. This is very sweet. It says Magic Mail Enclosed, and again, I've snipped the top open, but I have no idea what is inside. I'll Although I am seeing some colorful things and I think I see something Marie from Aristocats. Let me dig for, for the note first. Just a little note to thank you for making the world a more magical place. That's very sweet. I've enclosed a couple of little things I thought you might enjoy. Congratulations on completing your six parks one day challenge. You sure are a trooper. Thanks again for all you do for your viewers and most of all for making us smile. Lots of love. Natasha. Thank you so much, Natasha. That's incredibly sweet. And then tucked inside the envelope, there's a slightly more personal note, which I will um, read in detail after I've turned my camera off. So thank you. I really appreciate um, when people take time to, to write personal things. It means a lot to me because sometimes I just feel like I'm a stranger who opens boxes on the internet. So it's really cool to hear people's um, stories and things we have in common and, um, and how you found my channel and stuff. So thanks so much. So now let's see what's in here. All kinds of fun things. Oh my heavens. Okay. I'm just going to dig it all out and then, um, whoa, oh my gosh, there's more hippos, more Kinder Hippo biscuits. I am going to be eating these all summer long and I am not sad about that at all. You all know me so well. You know that I have a terrible sweets habit. Thank you so much for the Kinder Hippos. First of all, I've got a whole stack of them now. And there's a whole bunch of other really fun things in here. So I'm going to start with the item that was um, Marie from Aristocats. There is a set of two ballpoint pens. Here they are. I just love, love, love the uh, the packaging. And then I'm gonna take them out real quick cause, because I can. And this is such a sweet little pen set. So on one pen, you've got Marie kind of doing her Marie thing all around the pen. And on the other pen is just like this glittery pink ballpoint pen, which is, um, this is my kind of pen, people. So I'm really excited. These are gonna look so cute uh, sitting out on my desk. I've got a little 
cup back on my desk with a million Disney themed pens in it and these will be a perfect addition. And I think this next thing is a canvas tote bag. Canvas tote bag? Oh, it's a Ravenclaw tote bag. I'm getting hippos and Ravenclaw today. So check it out. It's a Ravenclaw canvas tote. That's adorable. I have lots of Disney totes, but not really much in the in the realm of Harry Potter. So this is perfect for me. I can get all decked out in all my, my Ravenclaw gear. Maybe I'll even put my Lady Ravenclaw pin on the corner of this cute tote. Thank you. And then there are two Snow White items, and these are both travel-themed items, um, and they're actually really funny. So the first one is a cute passport holder, and Snow White, my favorite princess, is on the front looking sleepy or distraught or both, and it says, get me out of here, and then inside you can slide your um, your passport book. I love this, it's hilarious, and, and it's perfect for me. And then the second item is also travel Snow White themed. It's a luggage tag. I need new luggage tags, by the way. This is perfect. And it says, upgrade please. And she looks like she's begging for an upgrade. And that's totally me. I'm such a, I'm such a wuss when it comes to travel and flying. So I always appreciate an upgrade. It, it rarely happens, but every once in a while it does. And it's like the angels sing when it happens. And finally, there are two really cute little buttons, little like button badges. And one says girl power. Well, girl power with, with no vowels. And the other one, I really love. It says fries before guys. Oh boy. I, I kind of think my life mantra has been like, Fries, yes please, and guys, yes please. But fries before guys um, is, is also good. These are super cute, thank you. Such a magical package from Natasha. Thank you so much. And all the way from Ireland. I've visited Ireland once. I think I was maybe 14 or 15. Beautiful, beautiful country. I've been kind of all around Ireland. I would love to go back someday. So maybe our paths will cross uh, in your country or mine. But thank you so much for, for reaching out. And I totally recognize you from the comments section and, and, and online stuff and, and big hugs. What a what a nice connection to make. This next mailer is from the United States and it's actually from a city that I will be in in just a couple weeks. This is coming from Las Vegas, Nevada. It says Bibbidi Bubbles. Bibbidi Bubbles in Las Vegas, Nevada. Interesting. Um, my in-laws, many of my in-laws are in Las Vegas and uh, Aaron and I are going to Las Vegas to see family and then we're gonna go and check out the, uh, the Grand Canyon, which is not too far from Vegas. And then we're gonna spend a few nights on the Strip. That's at the end of June. So I'm really looking forward to that trip and this package is reminding me of, of Vegas and my upcoming non-Disney trip. The note says, hi, my name is Wing. I've been watching your YouTube for a few months now. Love your Magic Meal Mondays, thank you. I came across this bell set with her blue dress on eBay and I had to get it for you. Oh, well, that's really nice. Beauty and the Beast is my ultimate favorite movie from Disney. Mine too. She also says that she recently opened an Etsy shop and there are some mini bath bombs. Oh, awesome. So Bibbidi Bubbles, Bibbidi Bubbles. That makes sense. So I guess it's Disney themed bath bombs and there is a coupon code. I'm gonna have to check with her and see if I can share that coupon code with, with you all. Um, I'll, I will double check. And then if, if I can, I'll put the coupon code in the, uh, the description box. Otherwise, I'll just link to the shop down below. Thank you so much, Wing. Let's see what's in here. I bet these are the bath bombs. And then I bet this is the uh, Beauty and the beast -y stuff. Let's take a look. Oh, there's multiple things in here. Okay, so first we have some Hallmark Disney Princess Itty Bitties. I've seen these before. I think I have a Minnie Mouse one. Um, but here they are. It's Belle and the Beast, and Belle's in her blue dress. These are super cute. I love Disney plush. And then there is also a really cute um, Disney princess uh, like stationery set. So there's a memo pad, two pencils, um, a sharpener, and an eraser. I love all the cute um, princessy designs. Thank you so much. I love me some Disney stationery and, and writing utensils. So I'll put these to good use for sure. And now this is the thing I'm like really excited about. I love when people do Etsy shops and like crafty things because I am not brave enough to do that myself. But this is from her new Etsy shop, Bibbidi Bubbles, and it's some mini bath bombs. I was actually thinking, because I'm not feeling that great today, that I was gonna take a bath tonight before bed, so maybe I'll get to use my Bibbidi Bubbles items. There are, I think, two, two lip balms. These look really nice. So they have coconut oil, beeswax, and sweet almond oil. 
Oh, and they smell really nice. There's two two lovely lip balms that she um, that she threw in, and I always need lip balm. I always try to sleep with a little bit on my lips because I gotta keep my lips soft for you know kissing my tigger and stuff. Oh, that was awkward. I'm awkward. And then here's the bath bombs. Look how cute the packaging is. Bibbity bubbles, all items handmade and cute little festive bow on the top as well. They are all very neatly um, and carefully bubble wrapped. So I'm just going to open one and take a look and see if it smells like anything. I love bath bombs. They're so much fun. This is cute. It almost looks like a little, um, I wonder what the design is. It almost looks like a little sandcastle. And it smells, it smells sweet and fizzy and maybe a little bit floral as well. Like very fresh scented. Mm, I can't really name the scent because I'm not the best at scents, but this is so great. I'm gonna try to use these tonight, Wing, so thank you so much. I'm gonna set these right back here behind me so I remember to bring them right over to uh, the master bathroom for my bath time tonight. Thank you so much. And I will link to your Etsy shop, Bibbidi Bubbles, down below. And I will send you a quick email to see if I can share your coupon code with my um, with my subscribers. And now here is uh, what remains for today's magic mail. I have two letters, which I usually save to the end. So I will save these to the end. And I have one very large, heavy box from Arizona, a big box from Shelby in Arizona. And it feels really heavy. I have no idea what is in here, but I'm gonna start with the box and then move on to the letters. So hello, Shelby in Arizona. Thank you for um, filling up my mailbox. There is a card that says Disney Kitty on the top. And oh, there's a bunch of fun things in here. There is um, a note and it says personal, which I will read off camera and some cute stickers. <gasps> and look at this really cute um, card. It says, sometimes all you need is one big hug. Can you see it? It kind of looks like Pooh Bear. I don't think it's officially Pooh Bear, but it, it kind of looks like Pooh. And the card says, hey Becca, this package includes, it either says many Disney items or mainly Disney items. Either many or mainly. I have a feeling that it's probably both, many and mainly. I hope you don't already have the pin. One is a real pin that I think would be fantastic for your newly growing Tinkerbell and Peter Pan collection. The other pin is quite small, but I'm sure it's it's going to bounce your way into its heart. Oh, that's so nice. I hope you enjoy the package from Disney Roo, AKA Shelby. Thank you so much, Shelby. I'm so excited to dig in here. There are a lot of items. So maybe she meant many and not mainly, but there's a lot of items in this box. Thank you so much. I'm so, I get so overwhelmed. The first thing I'm seeing is, I'm seeing Dumbo. There's a cute little Dumbo and he's got a little, um. He's got a little interim on his nose, so there's Dumbo. Let me get close to my camera. Gosh, so many things to show. It's a very cute little Dumbo figurine with a little cute inchworm on him. Super adorable, I do love Dumbo. Oh my word, there's a whole bunch of these little um, Disney statues. They're called mini garden statues, mini garden statues. Maybe I'm gonna place these in Tigger's potted plants and see if he notices that there's little Disney characters in his plants. <laughs> He'll probably notice. Okay, here's the other ones. So we have a Pluto garden statue. I think my husband will like this one because he's, he's into dogs right now. And a sassy Minnie Mouse garden statue, very adorable. A Bambi garden statue. This one will actually look really cute amongst the plants. And also a Snow White little statue, and she's my fave princess, so this one makes me especially happy, and she's got a cute little bluebird. All right, then I think these must be um, the pins. Love me some Disney pins. Disney pins are my favorite thing. Let's see. Oh, how cute. Oh, these are both fabulous pins. I'm so excited. Thank you, Shelby. I'm like pumped about both of these pins. They're super adorable. So we have on the top the sweetest little Tigger pin and my husband's called Tigger. That's his nickname. So I'm gonna treasure this forever. And then look at this one here. This is a uh, You Can Fly. It says You Can Fly, You Can Fly, You Can Fly. And it's my favorite scene from Peter Pan, which I'm obsessed with. They're flying in front of Big Ben. I love the song You Can Fly. The lyrics just make me so happy. And it actually has a little sliding um, moving element. Incredible. I, I have never seen this pin in person before and I, it's gonna be perfect for my collection. So thank you so much. I absolutely adore both of these pins. That was so thoughtful. And this next thing is in the shape of a box. Let's see what's in the box. Oh my gosh, it's Tinkerbell. It's some Tinkerbell mini statues. I love everything Tinkerbell right now. I'm super into Tink. It says miniature statuaries kit, Disney's Tinkerbell. Create your own mini outdoor living. Create your own mini 
outdoor living. I think this goes into a plant as well. I'm so excited to sneak around with these statues and put them in my husband's plants. My husband's into flowers and, and, and gardening and birds and I'm into Disney, so it'll be a perfect marriage. I'm just gonna let go around. <laughs> He's gonna freak out. I'm gonna put all these little statues in his plants and see what he does. But check this out. This is especially adorable. So there's Tinkerbell and a little toadstool and like a little um, pixie house. That is so cute and so sweet. And then you can see on the back how it might look when it's all set up inside of a planter. I love this. I've never seen this before. What a thoughtful, um, thoughtful gift. And I do love Tinkerbell. She's my, she's my, my Patronus. She's my mascot for 2019. Okay, and finally, there's two more things in this box, but I think one of them shattered. I think one of them maybe didn't make it. So let me pull out the first one that looks like it's in one piece. And I think this might actually be a planter, like a planter to put a plant in and then put the things in. What a fun package, it's like a super gardeny package. Yes, it's a Mickey Mouse pants flower pot planter. How adorable is this? My husband's gonna get such a kick out of this. <laughs> um, and then I think unfortunately, I think unfortunately the other one had an accident and like didn't make it. So we have, um, some bits and pieces of, of a second one, of a matching one. So I'm sorry that the other one didn't make it in the mail, Shelby, but that's okay. I think my husband will, will think that one, one Disney planter is, uh, is enough for, for, for us to share. So thank you so much. I loved that entire box. What a fun surprise. All those little gardeny statues and things, plus pins. That was amazing. Uh, thank you, and, and hello in Arizona. And I, I hope you're surviving the uh, summer heat. I think about you all down there during this time of the year. And last but not least, I have a couple of letters to share. This first one is from Christina in Arizona. Oh, also Arizona. We got Arizona and Arizona today. And um, on her uh, return address, it's a little kitty cat face and it says, every animal deserves a home. Yes, I agree. Oh, and there's a little bell sticker on the back. Hi, Christina in, uh, in Arizona. Thank you for sending me a note to my uh, P.O. box. Oh, beautiful car with beautiful birds. My husband is gonna love this. My husband is gonna love all the plant things and anything bird related, and he's gonna love those chocolate hippos. It's a very good magic mail day for, for Tigger as well as for me. And it says, Becca, I immediately thought of you and your husband when I saw this card, so I decided to send it your way. Thank you for sharing your love of Disney with us all. Your energy and positivity helps me get started with my days and in the right frame of mind. I also enjoy living vicariously through you as I'm still working on saving for my next Disney trip. Sincerely, Christina. Thank you so much, Christina. I love the card. I'm so glad that you enjoy watching my videos and good luck saving for that Disney trip. It, it can happen, you can make it happen. Sometimes you just have to sacrifice other things. Like for me, I sacrifice grown up clothes and uh, makeup and going out with friends so I can go to Disney. Um, but good luck planning for your trip and thank you for the sweet card. And finally, my last piece of magic mail from today comes from Australia. There's some really pretty Australian stamps on the front and then check out the sticker on the back. It's Cookie, Cookie from the uh, whole Duffy Bear and Friends crew. She is so adorable. So this is coming from Danielle in Australia. And let me open this up. Oh my word, now look at this card. This is another amazing, amazing card. And it's Pinocchio themed and it's gorgeous. You know I'm on a super big Pinocchio kick right now. And the card was handmade by Lindsay Loves. Lindsay Loves UK. I'll link to Lindsay Loves UK down below because this card is gorgeous. Check it out, it's a scene from Pinocchio, which Geppetto is just putting the finishing touches on. Pinocchio's face and, and Jiminy Cricket is looking on and there's even little Cleo down here and it actually looks like it's hand stitched onto the uh, the brown paper card. How pretty is that? It's very classy and, um, and fancy. And then here's the uh, card maker small shop down here. I'll link to it down below. The card says, Dear Becca, I've been watching your channel for a little over a year. Wow, and wanted to thank you for keeping the Disney magic alive all year round. Being in Australia, we have limited Disney merch, and I love to live vicariously through you. You always put a smile on my face. Thank you. I found this badge. I think badge means pin. <laughs> I found this badge at a little market on the Gold Coast here and immediately thought of you. I hope you like its uniqueness as much as I did. Thank you for filling my heart with Disney all year round. Danielle. 
thank you, Danielle. I'm super touched by this note. I'm in love with this card. I'm keeping this forever and ever. And here is the little, oh, it is like a little pin. It's a little pin badge. Oh my gosh, I love her. So it's Snow White with many beautiful artsy tattoos and her beautiful hair bow. And she looks like a perfect pinup and she is holding um, the bluebird. I love this, I've never seen um, this artwork ever before. It's very unique. I will totally add this to my Snow White pin collection. And thank you so much again for, um, for the pin and also for your super, super sweet card. And that is it for today's Magic Mail Monday video. I'm so glad I decided to sit down and film instead of just like laying <laughs> and like passing out in the other room, which is kind of what I felt tempted to do. That's probably what I'm gonna go do right now. I'm gonna take a bath and then I'm gonna have an early bedtime because I'm just feeling oh, a little wiped out. Um, thank you so, so much to everyone who sent me Magic Mail. I do have quite a few more things in the other room that I have not opened on camera yet, so I will get to it. And I know that I have a few outstanding emails that I need to answer, so if you're missing an email from me, look for that in the next day or two as well. I'm sorry I'm just behind because I'm so busy enjoying the beautiful weather and I'm just overwhelmed with summer. I, I love summer. So thank you again, everybody. I'll be back very soon with some more Disney trip vlogs. I've got some unboxings to share with you, some other fun things to share with you in the coming couple of weeks. And until then, have a magical Monday and I'll see you all really soon. Bye! And big, big thank yous.